morning from Escalante Canyon outside of Grand Junction, Colorado. Uh, my neighbor just asked me for, for some cream, so we're going to go out there in a moment and hook him up with some cream. Uh, my neighbor and friend, I should say. I'm out here climbing with him. Uh, yes, I did just say the magic C word. Blimey! That's that gear. Uh, cracks. Escalante. Anyway, just brushed my teeth, went for a little walk, and uh, we're going to go back outside here. It's a beautiful morning. Beautiful start to the day. Oh. Here is Escalante. Man, the last couple of days uh, before my buddy was like, hey, dude, you're already down there. Let's climb. Um, <laughs> I just came down here to do some mountain biking because the client canceled. And so I had two days, 11-mile uh, day, 11 mile day, and then a 20 two mile day um, and no it wasn't the same loop just doubled uh, totally different area but that's how it happened um, we were climbing these yesterday got out here for a half day after a little bit of in in service time taking care of interviews and such and um, but one of the things I figured uh, on the mountain biking side of life um, was that I would introduce I think I pointed it out before just saw it I think I actually like talked about the whole mountain biking thing though a lot of my uh, uh, my engineering or structural building decisions came from oh this happened so this won't work you know I did try to consider the whole sled thing where that you know I was sliding the sled underneath there and you know taking off the wheel like I've seen a lot of people do but I've already put two bikes back here, and I could do two right now, but I just like having the extra room, and I'm not going to ride road. Um, I'll ride road when I get back to where my other bike is. Um, but I could have two bikes and skis in here. I could probably even fit three bikes. Because so right now I have a 27.5. I had my 29er in my road in here, um, which is a 700C wheel. But what I did was one of these little garage racks that fold down and hang stuff, um, like rakes and such. You know, this, I could actually, you know, bend this all the way out, which there's no point in doing that. Um, but, you know, I put that in there, and that just holds the, it's like a wheel stay. And then the other wheel stays, and it's just right over here, there's little brackets. There's one there, and then there's one right here next to these snowshoes. Um, yeah, super, super easy, and it allows for, um, you know, I'll, not having this stupid, uh, wheel off, wheel on thing. Um, this is really nice. Just real quick. Um, as you can see, I just kind of secured it with some bungees there. And it just becomes multi purpose too, because it's not just bikes. You know? There's other, other things I could do with those stays when and if need be. Um, so we'll close this up. And ooh, dust coming off of my vehicle here when I close the doors. Um, yeah, let's, uh, let's go give this guy. What are you doing over there, guy? <laughs> uh, so I'm gonna bring some my neighbor some cream. Cream for the neighbor. <laughs> there you go, buddy. He has his cream. Almond milk. No, I don't say almond. I'm say almond. I also say R. Hard R. My buddy makes fun of me for that. Car bar star. Whatever. Uh, climb hard. All right. Have a great, wonderful day. From Escalante. Damn life. Peace out.